Dr. Mushelenga says he has been closely monitoring the state of affairs in Okahanja and received complaints from the residents about lack of service delivery. The suspension, the minister says, is also as a result of his assessment, which points to mismanagement, lack of accountability, general poor governance and service delivery on the part of the council. The combined effect of the above-mentioned instances of non-compliance, poor management and maladministration, is that the municipal council is unable or failing to perform its powers, duties and functions that have been conferred and imposed on and required of in terms of section 6, subsection 1b, section 11, and 21, subsection 1a, and section 30 of the Local Authorities Act, number 23 of 1992 as amended. The councillors in question are Congo Hinjo, the former mayor, Helvi Maruru, Hidion Uvukaeb, Sylvia Karuombe, Frederick Shimanda, Hileni Ita and Sophia Opitem. However, the councillors have not taken kindly to the minister's decision labelling it as biased and unfair. Something is fishy here, but I don't have a problem. I, for now, I won't say anything, but I will take this matter up with my party, which is UDF of Namibia, and uh, uh, my SG and my president will take it from there up. They accused Dr. Mushelenga of tribalism and teamed up with the CEO, who is on suspension, to dissolve the council and reinstated her. But Dr. Mushelenga described Mutilifa's suspension and procedural instructed Karweb to investigate alleged corruption against her and at the same time directed that Mutilifa assist in the running of the town's affairs. On the issue of service delivery, the council says its mandate is to pass resolutions and it is for the CEO to implement this. And I repeated on TV that the minister's statements and whatever is bias. Why did you not respond to our letter when we wrote to him regarding the suspended of the CEO? You know what the, the CEO told us? She's connected to the minister, she's connected to the people at the ministry and nothing will happen to her. And the uh, nothing will happen to her. Yes, and today we are suspended. Yes, please, we are suspended because we know this was coming. NBC reported earlier that Mutilifa, aged 62, has been operating from home where she had the council's official seal authenticating documents and correspondences from home. This includes blocking the swearing-in of office bearers at that town. Daniel Nadunyan, NBC News, Okahanja.